Hey everybody, Kevin from Palmetto Cats. Time for quick tip number 14. I'm sure some of you will agree, one of the most frustrating things about getting a new reel is putting line on that reel. Now I know there's probably a thousand different products out there that will help you with this. However, most of the time they're pricey and oftentimes they don't work like they're advertised. So I've come up with a quick tip that will help you with this with a few things that you might already have in your garage. The first thing you'll need is a five gallon bucket. Next, you just take your spool of line. I have a 30 pound Andy Monster line and I'm just gonna put that in the bucket. If you have smaller spools, this will work too. Now, if you stop at this point, what's gonna happen is once you start reeling, you're not gonna have any tension on your line. And then, once you start going faster, the spool will get out of control and flip over. So to fix this, we take the other items you probably have in the garage, shop towels, bait towels, whatever you wanna call them. You throw them in the bucket and that's going to put tension on your spool and it's gonna keep it from flipping over. And I'll show you how well that works. All right, I'm gonna load up this reel with line and Anna's gonna film the bucket. I'll show you how well it works. Ready? I'm gonna pull really hard so I'll show you that it'll stay. Nope. Some of the line came loose and it went right back tight. All right, everyone, that's quick tip 14. I hope it helps you out. You know the drill. Hit the thumbs up, hit the subscribe button if you want to see more, and don't forget to click the bell button. Until next time, happy fishing.